What's up, Power Crews? I'm Paradomics, and welcome to Auto Chess. So before you click off the video, uh, just hear me out for a second. So I, I know that <laughs> this is a weird game to play because it's a mobile game, and I am ashamed to say it, but I am addicted to this game. So again, I know <laughs> this might not be an interesting game. Oh, oh, it's deciding to load now, huh? You stupid piece of garbage. Okay, so I have been having problems with this game j with the recording so far. But during the gameplay, like playing the game itself, I, I was it's fine. I It's been fine so far. But trying to record this game has been a son of a bitch for some reason. One, it keeps kicking me out to the menu screen every time I start the recording during the... During here, right here. Uh, apparently, the game for some reason has this auto kick out if you do not interact with your uh, gadget for like one second or two but anyways uh, i actually play, what's this failed to connect game server I, I don't know oh i think it's just the server i think the server is bad okay so anyways uh before let's just start a rank before they kick me out of the game and let me request timeout what Okay, no. What the frick? Are you kidding me? Am I recording this in the wrong time? The server is down. When I decide to rec- I played this game a few minutes ago. And then it was fine. I lit- Literally minutes ago, I was playing this game. And it was fine. Why is it server down when I want to record a video? Wanna explain that auto chess? Hmm, auto chess developers? Can you hear me? Can you see me? Huh? Are you looking at me? Well, take some of this! Because I'm gonna make a video of this game, and you're not gonna stop me! You see this? Yeah! I'm not gonna let you stop me from recording this game, just because the server is down, and I can't record it! Well, you could just go eat a big bowl of d- Two hours later... Alright guys, so I am back! So apparently, there's something wrong with the Asia server. I don't know why, but apparently every time I join a match, I keep getting kicked for some unknown reason. And apparently in my, in my, in the Asia server, I'm still playing a game. It's just that I keep getting kicked. So the Asia server is having a problem. I'm now using the USA and Canada server, which is for some reason better and doesn't have a problem. I mean, I never had a problem with the Asia server until I started recording. So, yeah. Anyways, as you can see here, um, I'm back to level 1, but that doesn't matter, okay? That doesn't matter. I already know how to play this game. Uh, the level up system here is stupid. The the season pass here is also stupid. Like, look at this. Look look, look how they reward players who play the game without the season pass. Look at that. Level 50. Level 50 is the only thing you can... is the, is the last thing you can get in the junior in the normal season pass and look at the senior season pass all the way to level 200 they they get they get this lollipop which apparently is uh, the, a currency here that allows you to gamble <laughs> not really gamble it's more of a rng thing where you might get cool skins or um a better picture, a profile picture, you know, like, yeah, and all that stupid stuff. This is the dumbest season pass I've ever seen, like, ever. Even if I bought the senior season pass, I do not want to have just the stupid candies. I want to actually have something. Look, even in the end, like, the last thing you get in the senior season pass is just a stupid candy. They don't give you a skin for playing this long. This is the dumbest season pass in the world. At, I mean, at least Apex Legends has better season pass. It's not a good season pass, but this is that's somewhat better. I mean, yeah, in the season pass they give you they give you this skin, but we're not here to talk about the season pass. We're here to talk about gameplay. So the gameplay is where it's at. Everything else here is garbage, and you should not even bother trying to look cool or get a cool name because it's all pointless it doesn't matter what matters here is the gameplay and these are very very 
hmm, interesting characters. But this, this is how I play. I wish I want to get that other robot. So this is how you play the game. You put, you select a monster, and then you let them, you watch them fight. Yeah, <laughs> that's basically it. You just sit down and watch them fight, and I won, apparently. So the game here, the goal here is to be the last person alive, and oh my god, okay. And that's the thing too, it's, everything here is random chances, so apparently there's a little strategy here, but it's all based on luck. It's uh, whoever gets the, the best uh, characters ever so there is a way to level up the characters in order to level up one specific character you need to get three of the same kind okay so if i want to upgrade this robot to rank two i need to have the robot uh three times and the best thing too here is that they actually tell you if you have like if you have this robot or there's like th basically right here you'll see like it's called like there see the robot's glowing green because it you already have the robot, so it means you pick that. Let's get these because uh, they're tanks and we need tanks and tanks are good. So there is builds here. As you can see, like up here, you see the mech. These are the classes. So if I, I, if I put two mechs, two mech classes, uh, there will be a perk that you get called all friendly mechs have HP regeneration. So this guy and the robot gets regeneration. And anyone else... Or any other monsters that's classified as a mech will also get regeneration. And as you can see here, it's glowing gold. That means that means you can now evolve there. So now I have a level two robot. So three rounds, you'll be fighting AIs, and then in the fourth round, and to the last or whatever, you'll be fighting uh, actual players. So these are actual players, and I'm fighting them fighting their monsters obviously the, that monster was garbage i'm i'm clearly the superior one here so we all know that because i'm cool that way there we go there we go so i'm gonna actually get rid of the archer because i'm gonna go with the goblin class so the cool thing about the goblin class is that if you have oh i can put one more okay so here if i have three goblins uh it will grant random allies armor and 10 hp regeneration so you can upgrade, there is a level pack here as you can see, oh god, I didn't mean to click that, but I did. So um, adding, no, not you. Ah, damn it, I added her anyways. Okay, that was an accident. I didn't mean to add the Phantom Queen, but the Phantom Queen is a really good assassin class, but I already have an assassin class, which is Soul Breaker. So that was pretty dumb of me to do. It's okay, two assassins is better than one, right? The more the merrier. So apparently you can level up in this game. And then the more you level up, the more characters you can put here. And the better rarity you can get. As you can see here, there's a blue character here, like Venom. He's colored blue. That means he's a rare character. So you can see at the bottom here, there's like this light blue and blue and this purple one. I probably shouldn't be explaining it while playing the game, but I'm doing it anyways because I'm... Uh, I'm walking yeah okay so apparently I'm not gonna get rid of my phantom queen actually yeah I'll, I'll get rid of her and I'll add fallen witcher so the fallen witcher is a pretty cool character to have because uh, for multiple reasons he has this ability where he'll switch health with any random allies as you get here he swap health and he gets an additional attack boost but he was fighting a level 2 star character, so he's a bit of a piece of shit, but but he will get better! Trust me guys, this is not a boring game. This is very fun. It's really addicting. I'm not sponsoring this game, by the way. I'm not sponsored. Uh, I, apparently, they don't know. I'm not that famous enough to be sponsored. But if they do want to sponsor me, I will sure as hell do it for them. So anyways, even though if their season pass is a bit crappy, uh, I'll still sponsor the game because it's pretty fun. Apparently, I don't think they'll sponsor me. <laughs> okay, so uh, do I get Phantom? No, I got rid of my Phantom Queen. Okay, so here I'll just reset, see who else I can find. Alright, no one. Crap. Okay, I'll just leave it there. So, you can reset this. You, you have this silver coins. They call it gold for some reason, even though that's clearly silver. Uh, 
the, that's so you can buy more units or you can if you don't like the units you see here you can recite you can reshuffle it so they'll show you more units so that you can get a better chance of of playing the game as you can see here i don't want any of these i do want to get werewolf but i don't have a beast class and okay good soul breaker and that so uh okay we're not gonna put any of them yet we're gonna save them for later well, I can't put them anyways, but we're gonna save them for later when we get more of them. As you can see, I'll shuffle again. See if I can find... Oh, unicorn! Oh, do I want unicorn? Unicorn! Uh, no, no, no. I'll get Thunder Spirit though, because uh, if I put... If I put two Spirit classes, which is Stone Spirit and Thunder Spirit, uh, there's a... There's their perk there, or their passive... Or what do we call this abilities? Now I'll just call it the the spirit passive is that there's a chance for any friendly spirits to petrify an enemy class like 20% chance of petrifying them. Woo, so far I haven't lost one. Look at that, 100 health. Cassie, awesome. I'm so su I'm surprised that nobody took the name Cassie because somebody took the name Paradomix. Oh yes. Yes, okay. We got to upgrade you. There we go. Now we're cooking with gasoline, which is very dangerous because I could also die in the process. And hmm, I'm okay with who I have. So I'm gonna shuffle again, though. Yeah. Okay. Get these two. And let me level up so I can add Thunder Spirit. There. So Thunder Spirit and Stone Spirit can now will now have a 30% chance of petrifying an enemy for three, four seconds. Pretty cool. See, this guy's here. Stone to death. Nice try, Soul Breaker. You won't be breaking any souls today. Not when Thunder Spirit's here to petrify you with his thunder ability. You know, he should have the ability to paralyze. Not petrify. Who ever heard of petrifying somebody with lightning? That's stupid. Stupid. Okay, so apparently I kind of lied. There, you, you don't just fight players at specific rounds. Uh, you f start fighting, what do you call these guys? Uh, AIs. Yeah, I said that literally before, but now you start fighting AIs, and AIs are somewhat a piece. Of shit. Okay, more goblin, because we want the goblin build. Okay, more of these. Yes, thank you. And yeah, so we want to have at least six goblins, because six goblins will grant all allies 12 armor and 10 hp regeneration which is pretty cool uh why did you give thunder spirit the armor again it's random <laughs> but to get three goblins you need to get three different goblins so i got ripper uh he heavy bomber and skybreaker and if i need to add more i need to keep leveling up my characters oh, oh god they all lost to the rock golem okay good i can upgrade him and heavy bomber nice okay so far they're looking up things are looking up look at that i'm not i'm never this lucky again it's this game is based on luck there is strategy but you need to be very very lucky in order to uh win this okay life regeneration and gain mana regeneration okay build that and i'll give that to while dealing damage i'll give that to i'll give it to Fallen Witcher because Fallen Witch I, I need Fallen Witcher to use his ability as soon as his health goes down. So then, and then he swaps health with whoever has the biggest health and then he gets stronger, which is pretty cool. It's a sadistic thing to do, but it is what it is, okay? Sometimes you need sacrifice in order to beat bigger enemies. You gotta sacrifice big stuff. And also you can watch other players fight. Like you can go to Mr. Smoker, who lost because he sucks. <laughs> Unlike me though, I'm I'm cool. I'm the best guy here. Uh, no. But anyways, again, I've been playing this game for three days and I'm somewhat decent at it yet. I don't know any strategies. I didn't look up any um, online strategy things or like how, how to uh, make a class or how to make a build or how to do damage. So this is all just me randomly choosing characters. Again, I'm going for the goblin builds and... If I want to have more goblins, I need to level up more. And I can level up, I can gain additional four experience, but it will cost me five gold. And I need those gold in order to buy more units. And also leveling up, you don't, don't do that when you're, when you're trying to level up 
low rare low rarity characters like like my robot he's a low rare he's a low rarity class so the more i level up the lower the chances i'll get on getting the robot and the higher chances i get with cooler characters so ironically the bad the low class characters will start being more rare than the rare characters okay so um i don't like any of these guys a fallen witcher i do like him but i don't have space so i'll ignore him for now and try to go for the robo build um i'm not gonna get rid of, i'm gonna get rid of no i'm not gonna get rid of, i'm gonna get rid of heavy no i'm not gonna get rid of heavy bomber Okay, Stone Spirit will have to wait. Uh, Fallen Witcher, wait. Okay, here we go. So, there, there, there. No! No! Oh, I was trying to put another... <sighs> okay, so they, they give you like 30 seconds to prepare. And I kind of messed that up. But I am I have full faith on my characters that they won't suck. Yes! Okay, we're winning. That's good. But that's not what I want to do. So you can rank them up to three stars, and but in order to rank them to three stars, you need to have three two-star characters. As you can see here, okay. So you can see here, one, and where's my other robot? <gasps> oh no, did I not buy him? Oh no! Oh no, what happened to my other robot? Oh god, I didn't buy him, did I? Gosh damn it. Oh well, I'm just gonna put my two-star robot there. So anyways, if you put the same character uh, in the game, it's not gonna apply as a new character or like as a different character. You literally need to get a, diff a different class. So if you want to build up that goblin build, which, where am I goblin? Wait, what? Two goblins? No. I placed... What? Oh no, I re Oh god, I replaced my my soul breaker. Uh-oh. I hope I didn't give him anything. No, I didn't give my soul breaker anything. Okay, so I kind of have to get rid of my robot and put soul breaker there if I want to have the the goblin passive or the goblin What do you call them? It's got to be something. Okay, next we're going to fight AIs. I'm gonna, uh, God, okay. I'm just gonna get rid of Stone Spirit, okay? For, for now, we're trying to level up the bomber. Heavy bomber and the ripper. So, again, get rid of the robot, replace him with you, so that I get my goblin passive, which grants random people a chance to get armor. Okay. Oh, oh yeah, I forgot about that. Yeah, so the wolf packs here are a bit of a bitch, but they'll get somewhat easier. I forgot that this big guy here will distract your tanks while the four minions will go at the back and kill all your characters. And that is something I do not want. As you can see here, I'm dying because I suck. But hopefully, uh, my, my stone spirit will be as hard as ever and survive this. Please, please survive this. No, I don't think... Oh, okay, I lost this fight. I lost this fight due to ignorance. Yeah. Like I said, I'm not really good at this game. I'm still new. I'm just learning, okay? So don't judge me if I die or don't judge me if I lose. It is what it is, okay? Okay. Who do I sell here? Um, actually, let me just level up. And one more. There we go. And then I'll add my robot. And then buy the Heaven Bomber. Okay. Ooh. Okay. I saving money here is a is a good thing too, so that you can buy better units. I hope I'm playing rank, not casual. I feel like I'm playing casual. Oh man! I no, this is rank. We're playing rank. I think this this better be ranked and not casual. I would be so mad. It's like they're doing bad, but now I'm the only one doing good. Well, I did bad because of the AI. Anyways, let's uh, reset that. So as you can see here, they're giving me higher rarities like the Siren, which is like a rare class. But I don't need that right now. Yes, Thunder Spirit, give me that. 
evolved my Thunder Spirit. Now I got two star Thunder Spirit, which is pretty cool. And uh, oh, yep, we got another Ripper. It's a Ripper. Okay, get rid of my robot. So there, now I have four Goblin. Ooh, okay, I'm sweating because I'm actually <laughs> playing this game seriously. Okay, so ah, your assassins do nothing to my Ripper because my Ripper will rip her, rip him a new one. Yeah, good joke, me. This is gonna be a very long video because apparently it usually it takes 30 minutes to win a round. But as uh, as pathetic as my enemies are because they're seriously losing, I'm kind of curious what Hunt Soda's cooking over there. Will he survive? But can he survive me? That's the question. Okay. Oh! Oh, there we go. And then I got two star and I put this and I got three star uh skybreaker there he is three star skybreaker so i have a cool ass tank which is amazing you're beautiful you gotta love him you gotta love this game and i gotta keep resetting until i get okay I get a goblin yeah so fallen witcher good okay stone spirit okay we're not gonna look for stone okay fallen witcher okay we can upgrade for oh god i think it's too long Okay, so after this fight, I'm gonna upgrade my Fallen Witcher so he'll be ranked 2, so he'll stop dying and stop being a piece of shit uh, of a character. The sooner he gets his ability, the sooner he'll swap with another character's HP without actually punishing that character for, for the Fallen Witcher's lost HP. Do you understand what I'm trying to say here? If, if he loses less HP, that's good. So that the character... The character he's switching with will not die. Okay. So I keep switching. Give me a goblin, please. So again, this game is literally RNG. You never. You, aha! Yes! Yes! Give me my three star heavy bummer. <laughs> you can, this game can get very addicting when you get your favorite characters. Okay, let's start farming for. Um, the stone spirit because our stone spirit seems like he's actually he's doing good i feel like we can win by just <laughs> with this characters all right so again you don't want to level up fast if you're trying to level up low rarity characters as you can see here it's now balanced you get 30 percent chance of getting a low character and there's 30 percent chance to get a common character and then rare and then epic and then legendary i don't know i'm basing this off from fortnite that's i'm sorry if i compare this game Forgive me, game. All right, good. Now I got a two-star Soul Breaker. So Soul Breaker is an assassin class, meaning he has the ability to jump across the jump across the map, moving all the way here, and he is going to take down those pesky archers or those mage who are just hanging around the back while their tank is absorbing all the damage. And I'm gonna get another Ripper because I want a three-star Ripper. Okay. Uh huh. No goblin so far. That's not good. Oh god. Okay, let's watch the fight first before we start spending. Okay. Oh, it's an AI fight. Okay, that's good. Because the AIs here are pretty crap at the moment. Because I have good class. Oof. Okay. Oh god, they're losing. Th I feel like I feel like this is casual. I feel like I'm playing casual because good players shouldn't shouldn't lose. To this point, right? They should be upgrading. I feel like I better, I better, I really should not. I really feel disappointed if I'm playing on casual, not on rank. Cause I really, cause I'm winning, and I, I rarely win in ranks. Okay. Look at that. He's not putting his. He has a level two swordsman. He's not putting it in there. Why? And he's going up against me. Look at him getting destroyed by me, because he's not putting his. Level 2 Swordsman, at least put up a fight. And look at me, I won. I didn't even need to watch because I'm cool that way. <laughs> oh my god. I like how he died to me first before I beat my opponent. <laughs> okay. I... I gotta... Is this casual? Is this casual or rank? Okay, we got Ripper. And... Soul Breaker. Uh, Thunder Spirit is good. We just need more goblins. Give me goblins! Okay, no goblins. Stupid. Okay, I'm just gonna upgrade. And just keep upgrading. There. So I can add another character in there. I don't know who. 
I might I might need to level up faster so I can get uh, legendary characters. And the legendary characters, there's one legendary goblin and uh, I forgot what he has, but he has his he has this special where he puts a bomb and he kills everyone. I, I'm really confused. I, I really hope that this is rank. Because I'm doing so good. I'm on a win streak. Okay, the win streak broke because of those stupid AI. Ooh, okay, good. Mm hmm. Q, Q, there we go. Now we just need uh, one more. One more goblin gob. Wait, no, get out of there. Swap there. Just need another set of the Soul Breaker class, and then we'll be good. We'll be jolly good show. Okay, so, yeah. Again, RNG. RNG. It's all luck here. You cannot beat this game with pure strategy that is just 100% gonna help you. Okay, I... I'm just gonna go off the bat that I'm playing on casual. Because playing on rank is actually more challenging. Because there are actual serious players. So I'm playing on casual. Because I forgot I swapped to another account. Oh my god. So this victory will not feel special to me. Okay, I'm just gonna... I'm not gonna farm the Fallen Witch. I'm gonna farm... The soul breaker because I don't care anymore. I feel like this is just all. Wait, what does this do? Reduce target's magic resistance. Alright, give that to soul breaker. I feel like I should give that to my tank, but whatever. I don't feel happy about this. So if I win, I don't care because this is just another. This is just a casual gameplay. These aren't serious players. <sighs> it's so easy to win in casual because no one is playing it seriously. They're all trying to learn. So it's not really that fun. I'm basically destroying them. All right, there's another ripper. Okay, let's add another ripper because we can now add eight units because I'm level eight now. Yeah, look at that. Look at that. They're not upgrading. They're putting two star characters in the safe spot. You can get rid of werewolf and put toss champion so you can get so you can get a boost! Dang it, man. I'm so angry that they're not doing... They're not even trying. Oh, man. And they didn't even respond to my question. That makes them even more of a dick. Okay, elf headwear. Pretty cool. And combine. There. So I got that. You reduce the target's magic resistance. Okay, good, whatever. I don't care. Doesn't matter anymore. Ooh, defectors. The defector is really good because he has this ability that turns people into penguins. Yes, yeah, much as that sounds weird, it's actually very annoying that he does that. So, uh, okay. Oh, wait, nope. Oh, a stone spirit. Okay, that's good. But again, it's pointless because I'm not playing in rank, I'm playing in casual. But I don't think it matters. Because the point of the game is having fun, right? That's the point of the game. Yeah. Having fun. Uh, just... Uh. It's not enjoyable if they don't put up a fight! Like, come on! Put your freaking Tusk Champion and your Water Spirit in the battlefield! Get rid of Venom! He's a, he's a crappy... He's a crappy assassin! Water Spirit is more of an assassin! <laughs> oh my god, I'm just criticizing my opponents, which I shouldn't be doing, because that's actually helping them improve, rather than making me... Oh, here it goes! Here's another goblin, which is the Venomancer. They get rid of Ripper, and add them there, even though Ripper is better than the Venomancer. But I just need one more goblin, and now everybody will have shields and regen. But I don't think I'll get another goblin because I'll be killing the fools who tries to beat me. Like, let's look at Pola. See, he gets destroyed. You could have a, you could kill one of my, my one of my units if you just add your stupid two-star champions there. <sighs> uh, this point, this point just, just doesn't feel right. 
Okay, I got another Soul Breaker. Good. And rank three. Yay, I got a rank three Soul Breaker. Great, amazing. But it doesn't matter because I've been playing in casual all those times. And it's stupid because I wanted to play in rank so I can show off and fight better opponents. But no, I'm dealt with newbies. <sighs> Still having fun though. <laughs> like the feeling of trying to upgrade your character and then getting them this far is actually really good. I actually like that. That feeling of getting a three star character. It's super cool. Okay. Venomancer gets the rank up. Oh my god, at this point I'm just gonna make them form a line. I just Sayonara because I <laughs> He only has one health left. There's no point. This is this is this isn't a battle! This is an assisted suicide! <laughs> oh my god. Yep, look at that. I don't... I don't even need to try. I don't even need to try. Look at that. You, you're getting destroyed, and I don't even give a damn, and you're already dead. You died before I could even kill you. <laughs> Truly, the sage of chess is among all these eight. Yeah, apparently so, because I'm an experienced person, and I've been playing in casual. I wanted to play in rank, but I know my, I forgot to set it to rank. <sighs> I don't care. This, this doesn't matter to me because this is an account that I won't use. This is my American account. I don't care. Stop leveling me up. I don't care. Good. Oh god, I forgot there's another level up system. Yeah, look at that. I only lost once in my first win. Yeah, whatever. No, that was rank! I was playing in rank! Yeah, look at that! I, I was in rank! Why were they so bad at the game? You know what, at this point, I just feel like... I don't care anymore. But anyways, I'll end the video here. <sighs> so hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. You guys enjoyed my commentary skills. And know that I am really good at this game. I do love this game very much. And I'm not sure if you guys want me to keep playing this game. Uh, this game is pretty fun. You should, got, you should really try this out for yourself if you're really interested in this uh, mechanic that it is. So again, the season pass is very stupid. The chess pass. The dumbest thing I've ever seen so far. Disgusting. Get it out of my face. I don't want it. Gap. Yeah. But at least it's not a pay to win game. Okay? It's not pay to win. It's all luck. So just try this game. Find a strategy. And play it because it's cool. Anyways, with that being said, thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked the video, thumbs up the like button to death. Become a fire crew today and I'll see you guys in the next video. I've been pressing F the entire time, so stupid. I was close. Yeah, I'm not sure. Fine.